huge things done in the midnight sun by the men who boil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that would make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was that night on the marge of Lake LaBarge where I cremated Sam McGee. Now, Sam McGee was from Tennessee, where the cotton blooms and blows. Why he left his home in the south to roam on the poles, God only knows. He was always cold, but that land of gold seemed to hold him like a spell. Though he'd often say in his homely way that he'd sooner live in hell. On a Christmas day, we were mushing our way over the Dawson Trail. You speak of the cold through the park as fold and stab like a driven nail. If your eyes you close and the lashes froze till sometimes you couldn't see. It wasn't much fun, but the only one to whimper was Sam McGee. That very night, as we lay packed tight in our robes beneath the snow, the dogs were fed, and overhead, stars were dancing, hill and toe. He turned to me, and Cap says he, I cash in this trip, I guess. And if I do, I'm asking that you won't refuse my last request. Well, he seemed so low that I couldn't say no, and he said with a kind of moan, It's this cursed cold, and it's got right hold till I'm chilled clear through the bone. Yet it ain't being dead, it's the awful dread of an icy grave that pains. So I want you to swear that come foul or fair, you'll cremate my last remains. Well, a pal's last knee is a thing to heed, so I swore that I would not fail. And we started on at the break of dawn, that gosh, she looked ghastly pale. He raved, crouched on his sleigh, and he raved all day on his home back in Tennessee. And before nightfall, the corpse was all that was left of Sam McGee. There wasn't a breath in that land of death, and I hurried, horror-driven, with a corpse half hid that I couldn't get rid because of a promise given. It was lashed to the sleigh, and it seemed to say, you may tax your brawn and brain, but you promise true, and it's up to you to cremate these last remains. Now a promise made is a debt unpaid, and the trail has its own stern code. In the days to come, though my lips were dumb, in my heart, how I cursed that load. In the late, late night, by the lone firelight, while the huskies around in a ring howled out their woes to the homeless snows. My gosh, how I loved that thing. And every day, that quiet clay seemed to heavy and heavier grow. And on I went, though the dogs were spent, and the grub was getting low. The trail was bad, and I felt half mad, but I swore I'd not give in. And at night I'd sing to that hateful thing, and it hearkened with a grin. Till I came to the marge of Lake LaBarge, and a derelict there lay. It was trapped in the ice, and I saw in a thrice, it was called the Alice May. I looked at it, and I thought of it, and I looked at my frozen chum. And here, said I, with a sudden cry, is my crematorium. Some planks I tore from the cabin floor, and I lit the boiler fire. Some coal I found that was lying around, and I fueled the flames higher. The flames they soared and the furnace roared, such a blaze you seldom see. Then I burrowed a hole in that glowing coal, and I stuffed it in Sam McGee. Then I 
I made a hike, for I didn't like to hear him sizzle so. The huggins scowled, the huskies howled, and the wind began to blow. It was icy cold, but the hot sweat rolled down my cheeks, and I don't know why. And the jet black smoke in an inky cloak went streaking through the sky. I do not know how long in the snow I wrestled with grisly fear, but the stars were out and dancing about ere again I ventured near. I was sick with dread, but I bravely said, I'll just take a peep inside. I guess he's cooked, and it's time I looked, and the door I opened wide. And there sat Sam, looking cool and calm in the heart of the furnace roar. He wore a smile, you could see a mile, and he said, please close that door. See, it's warm in here, but I greatly fear that you'll let in the cold and the storm. Since I left Plum Tree down in Tennessee, this is the first time that I've been warm. Strange things done in the midnight sun by the men who moil for gold. The Arctic trails have their secret tales that would make your blood run cold. The northern lights have seen queer sights, but the queerest they ever did see was that night on the marge of Lake.